Android 11 launched with a new screen recording feature, but sadly it was rather limited. So while it was a nice feature to have, it only allowed you to record the entire contents of your display. Since then, Google has improved the functionality and with Android 15, it now has the ability to only record a specific application on your device. To begin, it's a good idea to go ahead and launch the application that you want to record. However, this is optional as we have access to an app launcher later on. We can then minimize the application or simply swipe down from the top of the display twice so that we have access to our quick settings panel. Now we're going to swipe over once to locate the screen recording quick settings tile. If you do not see this tile here, then it may have been moved or hidden entirely. So you can tap on the edit icon to see all of your quick settings tiles and then move it into an easy spot to find. So let's tap on the new screen record tile to reveal the updated user interface. And you'll want to make sure that this drop down menu here has the A single app option highlighted. Since you still have the ability to record the entire screen if you so choose. And there's another drop down menu here that lets you choose the audio input to either include the device audio, the microphone, or both the device audio and the microphone. We can use this toggle here to either include audio from those sources or to disable audio entirely. When you're ready, we can tap on the start recording button down here and that's going to bring up an application picker. So up here at the top, we'll have all of our previously opened apps, but we also have an application launcher down here at the bottom. So we're going to choose our app and then at the top here, you're going to see a countdown timer appear. This icon changes as soon as the Android 15 screen recording feature has initiated. And you may even feel the phone vibrate to give you an indication that the screen recording has started. So while you see the screen recording icon here and in your notification status bar, everything within this single application is going to be recorded. No matter where you are or what is displayed in that particular application, it will all be recorded. And the recording will continue until you swipe down from the top of the display to reveal the notification shade. From here, we have a notification for the screen record function and we can simply tap on the stop button here to initiate the end of that recording. As the file is created, you'll then get a different notification that lets you watch through everything that you just recorded. So from here, we can either tap this notification to view it, or we can share it directly from here. I enjoy seeing new features added to Android, but I really like it when Google goes a step further and adds additional features to make it competitive with third party options. And I've mentioned it before, but Android 15 really is an update that polishes many of its existing features. So seeing this option added to the built in screen recorder is something that I really like. Let me know what you think about this feature down in the comment section below. And please do not forget to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android 15 tips like this.